Man, I told you guys, man, you thought inflation was going to get better? It's getting worse and worse and worse and worse. But before we go in, go ahead, I can't do your thing, man. This Prince I can. I'm back here with some of my friends. Let's get it. And this is your man, Ronnie Ron. And this is your buddy, New Jordan Era. Let's go. Let's get it. Let's get it. Oh, uh, Jordan got a hot topic for us today, man. I'm here to, mm-hmm. I'm here to watch in. Go ahead. Okay, here's another quick take. So this is in my um, state. I live in California. So millions of California residents to receive up to $1,050 for inflation release. So, so Governor Newsom broke it out Sunday, uh, you know, since, you know, inflation's going up in California, you know, in, in, the, um, um, in the whole country. So for, for um, his day, he's going to uh, put into a relief plan, a relief plan for inflation, which, you know, um, if you have kids, uh, if you if you live in and you have kids, you can receive up to ten uh, one thousand and fifty dollars. And for people that make it, uh, I think it's seventy five thousand or, or lower, they will get uh, they will send a relief relief of three hundred and fifty dollars per group. Uh, if you're uh, with a domestic partner or you're married, they'll just send you seven hundred, which is three fifty, you know, times two. And it, and then if you're uh, 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 single parent, you know, if you have kids, you'll get the 350 and it will be a uh, additional 250 for per dependent. And uh, my, uh, so my, my guys, my question is this, do you think uh, other states should be doing this as well to help out uh, people with uh, inflation? Um, Me, I don't have a, I'm being honest with you. I'm being honest with you. What he's doing over there in California, I'm actually down for it because to me, it doesn't make any sense to send $40 billion to the Ukraine. Get that money and use that money on your own people in the United States. What he's doing, God knew doing it in California, kudos to him because you got to take care of your people, especially for a city like Budget California. Budget includes which use is of the state's $100 billion surplus and up to $23 million. Going close million. to $8, $8 a gallon. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. You get what I'm saying, Ikeem? Yeah, so yeah, I do. For, for, for that, for, and for you to see that, and for you to see that even online, for, for a governor like that to do it, do for what he's doing for his for his state, kudos to him. I'm down for it. I'm down for the for the inflation relief plan. For me, shoot, we better be paying these damn high ass taxes. So, ah, shit, I don't mind taxes. Here, so, <laughs> taxes. I'm, I'm sorry. When I first moved on from Florida and I moved here, like I said, no test was kind of hanging. I expected it, but I was like, okay, I got to see the endure how much I'm paying, you know. Taxes here is off the chain here, yo. And like I said, it kind of, that right there, it kind of made me like, okay, I need to save my uh, budget my money better and save my money better. Because, you know, in Florida, you know, I can spend here and do this and this and the sell tax rate is low. Okay, cool. California, it's like you're paying an extra two or three extra dollars, y'all like. And but then inflation's up too. It's, it's like, I ain't gonna lie, Joe, you're actually doing pretty good because now a lot of people I know can't live in California. I'm yeah. saying you're no. doing pretty good because a lot of people I yeah. know they cannot even survive in California for one day. Yeah, yeah, that's why for me, like I say, better for me to uh, budget my money, budget my money more and everything. But whatever, sometimes like I go, you know, try to get something to eat or something like that, and you know, you know. If I'm in a hurry, go to the fast food joint. You just look at the prices like, damn. Uh, you know, you wanna you wanna go get some, you wanna go home, go to the grocery store, buy some food and cook you some meals and everything. But but even that, y'all, you know, I'm, I'm with Governor Newsom to do this. You know, he's with the system doing this too. He was, uh he sent us like uh, two um two um relief plans from the uh, COVID too. So with COVID, he was sending us really I guess he keeps sending us um six hundred dollars, and he did it twice and everything. But yeah, for me, I'm just talking about here in California. Like, yeah, we, we definitely I, I, for, not just for me, for other people. Yeah, we definitely need it, yo. Know, but these, I feel to me, I just feel like we um we pay too much taxes for sometimes, especially in California, because there's some stuff that I see that needs to be paid, but especially for LA. I know from here, from LA and San Francisco, there's some places that like it's very, very dirty and everything. And, you know, I, I feel like, you know, for, for a person, I think the government needs to do a little bit better job on that. 
But other than that, you know, he was doing a decent job. Um, he's going for our re-election uh, this um, for this um, this year. And um, but yeah, man, you know, kudos. I'll say kudos, yo, because and I feel like you know, if other governors see this, you know, maybe they, you know, especially like you know, Florida, Georgia, Michigan, New York, you know, hopefully they could um um they could make a really plan, you know, and help, you know. With these other people that they need, you know, it, it don't need to be $300. It'd be $150, $200, a little something to help. But that's my take on it. Um, The math's off a little bit. The math's off. Um, the intent is beautiful, but I think that $250, $350 pennies is peanuts compared to what we spend every day. Some of our some of our expenses waver over two to three thousand dollars just for one person. You know what I mean? So when I see that, I like the idea, but they're gonna recoup majority of this money back through taxes. Don't let these people fool you. Absolutely. Point, you know what I mean? Just like when they made us file taxes for those stimulus checks they gave back. You don't think they're not getting that back? Do they getting that back? So the thing is. I love the fact that they got a stimulus bill. No nigga put up three, four grand per person. Three thousand dollars will really shape some shit. A nigga looking at that, he say, I could put up five, take twenty five, and catch up on some shit. But two hundred and fifty dollars. Hey, you know what, yo? I'm hold on, cause you make a real point. It's like you know, with that money right there for me, that's that's his grocery. Store. Hey. This, that's my new grocery shopping. Yeah, that's, that's it. The whole, that's, that's, that's the whole grocery shopping for me. That's two fifty right there. I go grocery shopping. Basically, how many people in California are back on they pay on they rent? Talk to me. How many people are back on they rent? A three thousand dollar check make a person. Woo! I can catch up on two months worth. Matter of fact, I'll be a month ahead. I'll be a month ahead. Double back. Put some up. Now I can play catch up. 50 300 are you are you pricing it before covid is that what you're, is that what the economists is doing or they doing pre covid numbers cuz those are not these are not now numbers though we in inflation where a pair of sneakers is 300 nigga i don't have nothing against mr garvin he's doing his thing but whoever's doing the numbers the accountant or whoever Tell them to come back, redo the numbers all over again. Because three stacks per person. Listen, three stacks per person, women with kids, five bands. $5,000 for women with kids or married couple. That can really, that can, listen, a $5,000 check to a, a couple with two, three kids, they're going like this. They just saved our life. Not two, not a thousand dollars. You wet, you just wiped through my mouth here. With that's all I got to say. That's why I say let's run the numbers back. No, but you do make a good point. I didn't really think about that in the aspect of the numbers. If we actually do the numbers the way you said, you can make a, a lot of logical sense. But I think he still did a good deed because no other state is doing what he's doing. No, no you're right. So I, I have to get kudos to that. I get, I give him credit for that. I give him credit for that. Don't get me wrong. When them stimulus checks came and they was giving people twelve hundred dollars per stimulus check, that had made a difference. Over a thousand dollars made a difference. Even the people who had money, they was up ahead on shit. If they would have set a five hundred dollar stimulus check, I said, "This ain't nothing. I'll go wash some cars." A thousand, twelve hundred, fourteen hundred. Whoa, yeah, they really, they really. Well, I'm gonna catch up. I'm not gonna lie. I caught up and brought some crypto with that. That's why I was saying the money they send overseas to the Ukraine is unnecessary. It should be using our resources here in the United States and take care of the people. That's why I stated earlier. But just imagine what he's doing. If that money from the Ukraine was here, it would we would be able to double the money up. Think about it. Think of the math. Listen, I'm gonna say something, and I don't mind if people don't like me. You sending money to a bunch of white people who don't even like nobody. Exactly. These are known, documented racists. Even Putin, listen, 
Don't make me come in. Don't make me come in and say hell Putin. Don't make me come in and say hell Putin. Don't make me do that here. Because let me tell you something. I ain't never heard them call nobody no nigga in Russia. I ain't never heard them call no nigga in Russia. I have had documents of them boys out in Ukraine doing their thing, not really effing with us like that. Mm. Am I wrong, fellas? Listen, these are all, this is just my opinion. This is all not directive. I don't have nothing, to, I shouldn't have nothing against people I might not never meet. Who I might not never meet. Mm. I, I know for a fact, I live around niggas and, 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 and I want to die around niggas. Yeah, I already know, man. You already know how we get down over here at KI Culture Radio. We out. Peace. Peace.